Hi guys, in this section of the DVD, we'll spotlight some of the kicks and techniques featured in the film, and we'll recreate them in a sparring environment. I have with me two stuntmen from the Rebel to help us recreate that. You might remember this first technique from the very first action scene. Let me walk you through another perspective of it. So in a sparring environment, when my opponent would attack with kick, knee, punch, I like to sting him up a little bit, create distance before I throw the knockout blow. So now here it is uh, again in real speed. This next kick was featured in the final battle between um, my character and the villain. I came up with this technique because one of my favorite kicks um, is uh, the axe kick. Let me demonstrate. It's a really difficult to defend against technique because of a downward uh, action. Um, and we're more used to defending or fending off um, strikes that are coming straight forward from the side or from the bottom. Uh, the problem with the axe kick is it doesn't deliver much power and it's more used as a defensive technique. So for the rubble, I came up with a technique that throw my whole body weight into it, and it could also be uh, used as an offensive weapon. Let us demonstrate in uh, full speed. Inside leg kick, really effective to chop down your opponent. Let me demonstrate. When he pays attention to his leg, we'll go for his head in one jump kick move. There's also um, 21 leg techniques in the Vietnamese martial art called um, Bo Vi Nam. Now we demonstrate three scissor kicks in the movie. So let me demonstrate one more here for you guys, all right? Yeah. Once you get him here, you can choke him out, break his neck, hammer fist, or just knock him out. That's it for the demo. If you guys want to try it at home, be really careful.